It's just after midnight on Friday morning. Crews have been working to contain this fire. It's located on the Salt Lake Ranger District of the Uinta Wasatch Cache National Forest. Now, that is just east of Bountiful, and that's where we find ABC 4's Nicole Newman. And Nicole, please think this destructive fire was caused by a campfire. Nick, that's right. You can see for yourself the damage that this fire has caused. Acres and acres of land ravaged by these flames. Now, today, firefighters are working to rehabilitate the fire lines to help prevent erosion. It comes as police work to find the people who built the campfire that's believed to have started this. Now, an update on these numbers the fire is 80% contained and has burned 321 acres. The acres burn is slightly lower than previously reported. This is because officials say they now have a more accurate assessment. As far as resources, there are still two hand crews, two engines, and a total of 125 firefighters working to fight this. Less than two hours ago, we captured crews performing what's called cold trailing, where they feel with their bare hands for hot spots. Now, as far as the cause, this is still under investigation. However, officials believe this fire was ignited by an abandoned campfire. The fire was reported after midnight, but the individuals were seen earlier that evening around 9 p.m. sitting around a campfire at the location where the fire started. Officials don't have much of a description, but say they are looking for two people who were in a small SUV. Meantime, a team will be in place this week to assess the impacts of this fire to determine what steps need to be taken moving forward. Crews will also mop up hot spots that are nearest to the containment lines. Officials say residents can't expect to see smoke in the interior of the fire this coming week. Now, tomorrow, this fire will be turned back over to the local forest. Crews will be patrolling the fire and taking any further actions if needed. Live in Bountiful, Nicole Newman, ABC4 News.